just can and kick it. Hey, what's up, guys? Lastic over here, and today I just wanted to make a short Dragon Ball Fighters kind of like beginning tutorial video for you guys. This is something I definitely recommend all of you learn uh, just so you can get the core fundamentals down of how combos work in this game if you're new to anime fighters. This was the guide for you. So, we're gonna start. This can be done with pretty much every character on the roster. I haven't ran through all of them, but all of them have this this one. This is something you don't want to do, is just mash and do the auto combos as you see. It's not that big of a payoff. So, what you want to do is stop doing that at ASAP. It's a bad habit to get into. It's not good for hit confirming, but other than that, I wouldn't recommend it. It's a bad habit. I just see that barely did any damage. So, what you want to do here is standing light. We're going to break this up into two parts. So, everything before the jump cancel and then the jump cancel. And we're actually going to break this up into three parts. So, we're going to start off really slow. You got um, standing light punch, crouching medium, and then standing medium. So, just put that together. It should look like this. After this kick, after the standing medium comes out, which is this kick like this you can actually cancel it into a jump, jump forward. See? And that enables you to start your air combo and start carrying up the screen. So, what you're gonna do after this, after, so it's gonna look like standing light, down, standing light, crouching medium, standing medium. So, that's when you're going to do your jump cancel. And then you're going to go from there, when you're in the air, and towards your opponent, you're going to hit... You're going to hit a light medium, jump cancel again, and then down and heavy. So like this. And you'll actually hit your opponent up. So, starting off, looks like this. Alright, so that's what we got so far, and that is down and heavy to extend the combo. After that, just mash heavy, and you'll get Dragon Rush automatically. After that, you want to do, you can either mash light for a hard knockdown, or if you got somebody like Vegeta, you can actually uh, go into uh, level 3 super. And whether you want to spend the money, bars or whatever, this is just something to mess with. But what you want to do is you just want to get used to doing something like this. So you can kind of get that combo rhythm down. Because a lot of the stuff you're going to you're end up going to hit your opponent in there a lot. And then what you want to do is you want to see what is cancelable, what can you combo off of, what what's the most damage you can give for the least amount of bar you got to spend. So... Obviously that won't connect. So, and that's and this will work with any character. So, um, to show you, I'll switch characters right here, and we'll do this uh, same same exact string, same exact buttons and everything, but with Tien instead, or how I like to say Tien Shion. Sorry, my execution is a little rusty. Been playing Injustice a lot lately, still. See? So, an instantly jump. Missing the instantly jump. <laughs> it's only like that. I spent zero bar. I got 3,085 damage, which is not bad, but um, definitely not the best. But um, that's just you just want to get started with building your own combos, and it's a good way to start so you can learn how to uh, combo. And you can actually fit two down heavies in one combo. Just something still I'm still working on. If you guys enjoy the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will get back with you guys. Uh, out. <laughs> Let's <laughs> go.